Hey friends, it's Jay Rye. Thanks for coming back to the channel today. We're going to sit down and watch some TV together. This is a very special show when the Muppets first came into the Disney company. So back in 1990, Jim Henson and the Walt Disney Company, Michael Eisner had made a deal to bring the Muppets into the Disney family. And so of course, because it was Michael Eisner, they put the Muppets out everywhere so they could maximize this you know, venture together. So tonight we're going to watch The Magical World of Disney. This is a TV special that was on NBC. They had a whole series all year long where they would promote Disney movies and Disney products on NBC. Also remember, this is 1990, so this is before Disney owned ABC. So they did have this deal with NBC for some time, and this is a really funny special. I watched The Muppets ever since I was a kid, and I love them. They're funny, they're very unique, it's not everybody's taste, and even with the merger, you know, all these years later, you know, The Muppets, it's like, they have their space and they kind of work, but also, I don't know, they don't always fit the Disney Bowl, but who cares? Let's have some laughs. Let's watch this. This is the magical world of Disney as it aired, taped off my own VCR back in May of 1990. This is the Muppets' first introduction as being part of Disney. They took them to Walt Disney World and they ran amok all over the different resorts. At that point, there was the Magic Kingdom, there was Epcot Center, and there was uh, the Disney MGM Studios, which was the new park. Uh, they didn't have Animal Kingdom yet, so they're running around all the three parks and all the craziness that ensues. Charles Grodin is in this uh, special as well. So anyway, take a watch. Let me know your thoughts. Do you love the Muppets? Could you pass on them? What do you think? And also, watch carefully because I'm leaving the commercial in, commercials in on purpose because there are just so many funny things of uh, what they used to uh, sell products back in 1990, very, very long time ago. Anyway, take a watch and let's enjoy the magical world of Disney with the Muppets coming to Walt Disney World. Here we go, enjoy. Ah! The Muppets break into Walt Disney World. Where's Mickey Mouse? There's so much to do. He likes this family. And they can impress you everywhere they go. Who's this jump down? He's probably rounding up a posse to come after us. Their assignment is to capture the Muppets. All right! You call Charles Rogan. Looks like trouble. Come on. Hey, it's that easy thing ring. And Cosby's Whip and Simone guest star with the Muppets at Walt Disney World. Oh, that'd be really nice. Mm -hmm. oh, 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 Welcome, everyone. I'm in the lobby of the Grand Floridian Beach Resort at Walt Disney World. It's the perfect place to have tea with Fozzie Bear and his mother. Four uh, lumps or five? Oh, no, Marie, thank you. Uh, I'll take six. Uh, would you care for some honey? Uh, no, thank you, darling. Ah! Waka waka. waka. Tonight we have a really exciting Disney special for you. Kermit the Frog has packed up his entire family of bears and pigs and chickens and brought them here to Florida. It should be a grand adventure. Right, Fozzie? You betcha, Mr. Reisner. Oh, oh dear, I, I got butter all over your sleeve. Oh, that's okay. The cleaners can take care of it. Oh, no, Mr. Reisner. We can take care of it. <laughs> <laughs> They're here. We 
You've been walking for a long time. Are you sure we're on the right path? Please, Floyd, I grew up in these swamps. Oh, I think it's great to be coming back to the swamp to rediscover our roots. Ooh. Hey, there's one now. Thanks. It goes with the poison ivy. <laughs> poison ivy? <laughs> Well, that's one thing Beaker will never have to worry about. He's just used Muppet Lab's new anti-poison ivy cream. It makes you break out in spots and itch like a dickens, but at least you don't get poison ivy. Well, why on earth did you ask me on this trip? Oh, uh, it's a present, Ma. A little treat from me to you. Oh, you're too kind, Fozzie. Oh, way, way too kind. <laughs> Oh, Mommy Piggy. Well, are you sure you're going to eat all of this luggage? I mean, you don't have to dress for the alligators, you know. Alligators? Ah, are we going to see alligators? Ah! Only if you're really, really lucky. Ah! Ah! Ah, Camilla, this will be the vacation we've always dreamed of. Oh, just the two of us, my little titsy fly. <laughs> oh, you're really, really lucky. Oh, Kermit, why have you brought me to this tacky jungle? Uh, well, Piggy, it's a surprise. With this much, I can tell you, we are going to paradise. Paradise. <laughs> Wonderful to see you guys. And uh, this is your grandnephew, Robin. Hi, everybody. Hi, and, Robin. And these are the Muppets. Uh, guys, these are my aunts and uncles. We got uh, Harry and Mary and Larry and Terry and Gary and Perry and Emmy Lou. Well, howdy, Harry and Mary and Larry and uh, Mary and uh, Mary. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Oh, hi, Frog. I'm being bunny, but I'm learning to speak, Frog. <laughs> ribbit, ribbit. He's so cute. Oh, <laughs> oh well, well, that's his job. You see, the rest of us got sick of being cute, so we hired him to do it. <laughs> Come up, this is a stinking bog! Yes, isn't it terrific? Hey, Kermit, have you tasted this year's crop of mosquitoes? Oh, one of the best! Stop it! That is disgusting! Well, what's wrong with a, with a frog eating a few mosquitoes? Well, we wouldn't mind if you wanted to waddle in the mud with your pig buddies. What? Hey, everybody! Why don't we sing some of the old frog songs? Okay. It's not that easy being green. Oh. Oh. Yeah. 
give it a rest, will you? Oh, what's the matter? That is a swamp classic. All right, all right, all right. Enough of this, Kermit. What is the big surprise you promised us? Okay, I will tell you, and Piggy is going to make you feel so good. Can't make me feel worse. Because today is the annual Frog Festival and Bug Frog. Yeah, Piggy. Yeah, feel worse. And you're all invited. Yeah. Much worse. Y'all are going to love the festival. And tonight after the bug fry, we're going to sit around and listen to the fireworks from Walt Disney World. Yeah, Walt, Walt Disney, Disney World. World. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. Walt Disney World is just on the other side of those trees over there. Let's go, everybody. Yeah. But, but wait a second. What about the Frog Festival? Kermit, you don't understand. You are asking us to choose between Walt Disney World and fried bugs. Well, I... Uh, listen, listen, maybe if they just take a, a quick peek at Walt Disney World and then I'll, I'll have them back real soon. <laughs> we'll save some fried bugs for you. <laughs> Quentin Fitzwaller here. Yes, sir, as a matter of fact, it was me who lost the 700 sets of keys to the Epcot front gate. But good news, sir, I went back and I found nearly 100 of them, so there's only 600 lost. Isn't that great? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Well, well, sir, last chance is better than no chance at all. Security's work, sir. Uh, hi there, uh, can we come in? You got your tickets? Uh, uh well, uh, ma matter of fact, I, I just remembered I left my wallet in my knapsack back in the swamp. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah. Any of you guys got any money on you? Well, gee, Kermit uh, always does that stuff for us. Yeah. Well, I guess that means, uh, no Walt Disney World today. Oh, oh no. But if we hurry, we can be back in the swamp in time for the marinating of the bugs. Marinating of oh. the bugs. Yeah! Hey, come on, you rats. It's like distant family. Oh, it will be wonderful, you see. Oh, it'll be wonderful, you hear. Hey, come on, Fuzzy. Let's get something to eat. Uh, we can't just walk in like that. We'll all get into trouble. What? I'm afraid so, little frog man. The magical world of Disney will return after these messages. Recently, Four Wheeled Off-Road Magazine took this year's 4x4 of the Year winner and all the past winners and conducted a head-to-head -head showdown to determine the best of the best. So who won? Who do you think? There are a lot of 4x4s out there, but there's only one Jeep. Get a thousand dollars cash back or zero percent financing on cheap charity. Oh, shad friends, strawberry sweet, cranberry crisp. Oh, shad friends, most refreshing. Strawberry and cranberry, what a refreshing new idea! They know they want to win. They look at the judge and they ask for it. The show dog begins with what you feed it. I mix the pedigree with the pedigree meal time because the dogs enjoy it. It's the perfect combination. These are champions. They deserve the best. Pedigree. Recommended by top breeders. The comedy lineup continues. You know the old owl. I must eat cats. Will a new family kitty mean a new owl? It'll be like the son I never had. Tasty dessert treat, your furry friend. Whoa. Find out next. And Mary takes to the streets on a special all-new 227. Before he was homeless, he was a St. Bernard. Alpha 227, next. Now, back to our program. Well, you see, it's just that it's really difficult for a frog to carry cash with him. I mean, just look at us. No pockets. You can trust my Uncle Kirby. Hmm. Oh, if my supervisor found out about this, I'd be under the benches scraping you spearmen for the rest of my career. Well, well, I've got a credit card, of course, but I'm afraid I left home without it. Uh, Marge, uh, 
Uh, Quentin and Fitzwall are here. Um, I've got to go find some um, uh, the people, uh, th well, whatever. Uh, could you send someone down to keep an eye on a Mr. Uh, Kismet and his uh, uh, nephew? Uh, it's Kermit, actually. Uh, they're, they're two crazy gentlemen. Uncle Kermit! Look! My friend! My friend! Oh, it's hard to know where to start. There's so much to do. Hey, B, look at these fountains. Oh, they're great. They sure wow. are. Oh, boy. Wow. Fifteen love. <laughs> Cute is his middle name. Actually, it's Norman. Oh. <laughs> it's really a delightful place, you know. Oh, actually, you don't know, do you? Uh, Beaker, come along, come along, this way, right over here. Ah, oh, come on, hon. Here we are at last, just the two of us. Aww. Now, what would you like to see first? The Wonders of Life exhibit, or uh, uh, the ocean thing over there? Or, uh... <gasps> What's that? Oh. <coughs> Woo, it's a used paper cup exhibit. Boy, these Disney people are always on the cutting edge. Camilla, huh? look at those bent drinking straws. Huh? Oh, yeah. There you go, Beaky. That should help. <laughs> or not. Uh, well, you see, I'd be happy to pay for the ice creams that Animal ate, but you see, we frogs have this real problem with pockets. Uh, you know, no place to put money. And, uh... At uh, I don't think he understood, Uncle Kermit. Oh, well, uh, let's go back and try to set things right with that security guard. You know, I bet he thinks we sneaked into the park. Uh, actually, we did. Uh, well, all the more reason to talk to him. <laughs> Uh-oh, he's not there. Uh-oh, he's probably rounding up a posse to come after us. <laughs> yeah, on a bun. I want it on a bun, and I'll take it with mustard. Mustard and ketchup. Yeah, yeah. Relish? Yeah, I'll take relish. Well, no, no. Just a basic with mustard and ketchup. That'll be fine to start with. On my second one, I'll have... Uh, gotcha! Uh, hey, ho, 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 watch it. You'll wrinkle the fur. You're part of the kismet gang, aren't you? Maybe, maybe not. Maybe I'm just a simple rat on holiday. Oh, yeah? Well, we don't allow rodents in the park. Oh, yeah? Does your boss Mickey know this? Mickey? Mm. Well, Mickey. 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 Mickey, Mickey. Look, you've got to help me find the kismet gang. Well, what's it worth to you? Anything. I'll pay anything. Oh, exactly my price. You can start by paying for this hot all dog. All right, all right. Now, where are they? Well, first of all, they're called the Muppets. The Muppets? Yeah. Got two T's, one P? No, 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 no. Two P's, one T. S at the end. Well, where are they? I, I wonder which direction we should be taking. Well, it's kind of pleasant right around here. Nonsense! Where we want to be is the Chinese theater. Oh, yes. I want to see the autographs and footprints of all the stars in the sidewalk. Uh, well, Miss Piggy, I think that's probably a long walk from here. Walk? Uh, walk? Walk? Well, I'm certain someone can give us a ride. <gasps> you want to ride? Well, right this way. Come on. Oh. Hey, they got a pet care center. Maybe they can help me. Excuse me. Hmm? Who's your owner? Owner? I have no owner, sir. Aha. Uh -huh. But perhaps you can help me. You see, the Walt Disney World is such a big place. I don't know what to do with all this incredible freedom. Well, now, there's a solution I hadn't particularly thought of. Come uh, on. Uh, but you don't on. understand. I got a license. You were a fan of these thrill rides. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I know what you mean. Once you start, you just never want to stop. Come on, Star Tours is over this way. Hey, you know, this ice cream's really good. Now all we need is some root beer. Would you stop eating and help me capture the Muppets? Hey, I can't scheme on an empty stomach. But if you want to capture the Muppets, you gotta watch for the weird and unusual. Fitzwaller here. World Showcase? Scandinavian cook? 
And a guy with a bucket on his head? Bullseye. <laughs> Well, my friend here would like one of your fine tacos, please. Please! Yo, yo, van Svenska taco. Nu, nu prunsku vimpi dol sauce. Dan never de prunsu de dreary medsi medsi sauce. Then you hot and tot. Hoover, hoover, macho, yo, yo, sauce. Well, I think he would like the last one, please. Me? Speaker, you'll feel much better after a snack. Bon appétit. Oh, Speaker, you're looking much better. Oh, oh, look, Ma, there's a place we can have lunch. Oh, what a gift for a nice honey sandwich. Let's go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, Ma, I forgot we don't have any money. Oh, no. Oh, sorry, Ma. I guess this means no lunch for us today. Oh, darn. I wouldn't be too sure. What? And now, ladies and gentlemen, presenting Ma. the world's funniest comedian. Ma! The one and only Ma! Fuzzy no, no, Ma, please don't do this to me. Stop, Ma, please. Ha, 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 ha. Ah, uh, hiya, 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 hiya. Hey, a funny thing happened to me on the way to the theme park. Put some money in the hat, folks. A little money for some honey. <laughs> oh, I love it here. Yeah, it's beautiful. It's perfect. Absolutely. I can't think of a thing to complain about. Mm. It's pretty, pleasant, neat, clean. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I hate it when there's nothing to complain about. This is terrible. Yeah, why did we come to this miserable place? Boo! This! This! Close this dump down! Taxi! Taxi! Get us out of here! Oh, Camilla, isn't this just keen? If we hadn't taken that unmarked stairway next to the broom closet, we might have missed this whole grungy tunnel exhibit. Grungy? Oh, we're on the back lot in the New York set. This is great. Well, this is okay. I mean, it's not like the swamp, of course. The frog festival will have already started. You think we're missing anything? Well, of course. They've probably started the mud ball game and the skimming derby. Skimming derby? Yeah, to see how much pond scum you can skim. Scum skimming is a great sport. Pretty nice, all right. Say, like, what is this place anyway? They call it World Showcase. Looks like China or Japan. Here it does. Over there, it looks like England. Wait a second. A thought is just cerebral cortex into my cranium. Oh, the good doctor has an idea. What do rock musicians want to do more than anything else in the world? I know, I know, I know. <laughs> besides that. <laughs> besides that, what rock musicians want is a yeah. world tour. Right. You got it. And here you can have it. Why, we could do a world tour every afternoon. And like be home in time for dinner. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> To the stage, let the party begin. Open up the door and let everyone in, cause you know we're rocking all around our world. We get out and dig in every gig we play, get new friends all along the way as we go. Rocking all around our world. You don't have to worry, not I'm sure you'll agree If you don't speak the same language as me Cause when we rock together, we will really be uh, 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 uh. One big family Rock and rolling around the world Rock and rolling the world around Rock and rolling around the world Now I want to see their faces if we put up the lights Wanna lift the people up to brand new heights We'll go Rockin' all around the world When you get to ring up to the concert hall Music has a magic way of bringing down the wall Cause you know Rockin' all around the world Now you don't have to worry Now I'm sure you'll agree I'd pray If you don't speak the same language 
Magical World of Disney will return after these messages. What could be better than the new Domino's Pepperoni Pizza Feast for $8.99? Another one for just $4 more. More pepperoni than ever before and loads of extra cheese for just $8.99. And another one for only $4 more. But don't go out. Just pick up the phone. TCBY frozen yogurt is the greatest in the universe. I wouldn't miss it for the world. Hmm. I wonder if Mars is still open. At Ford, we've anticipated the needs of a changing world by completely rethinking the way we make small cars, working to reduce our margin of error to zero. And in creating a new process, we created the new Ford Escort, designed and built to rival the best small cars in the world. Introducing the next Ford Escort, a new line of thought a new line of cars. Have you driven a Ford lately? Do certain women possess a beauty secret you do not? Yes. New DuPont Certified Stainmaster Luxura Carpet. It's richer, it's thicker, and it's Stainmaster. Exclusively DuPont. The comic book you grew up with has grown up, too. And boy, Archie's got girl trouble. You think I'm trying to seduce you? Yeah. With Veronica. You do catch on quick. Betty. Treat me like a woman. And his fiance too. Surprise. A reunion they couldn't put in the comic book. I'll be waiting. It's Archie's 15-year class reunion tonight. Wow. And now, Cops on Beat in Hollywood. Stop! In the name of love! Coming next Sunday, do it yourself, TV. Have some rhythm, boys! Now, back to our program. Oh, there's nothing more romantic than these old-fashioned horse drawn collies. Hello! Hello! Who's your lady friend? Who's this little girly by my side? I've seen you. A guy or two. Oh, 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 we are surprised at you. Hello, hello. Stop your little game. Do you think my ways I ought to mend? It isn't the girl I saw you with at Epcot. Who, who, who's your lady friend? I say, I say, who was that lady I saw you with at Epcot? That was no lady. That was my nurse. Oh, <laughs> your nurse. It is the girl I saw you with at Epcot. Who, who, who's your lady? Who, who, who's my lady? Who, who, who's my lady friend? <laughs> this is a good idea you have. Thanks. With a team of agents, we can sweep the park and capture the Muppets. Mm. There'll be no gum scraping for me. <laughs> you're not so dumb for a rat. Well, we're even then. You're not so smart for a person. Yeah, uh, listen, you better give your instructions to your men. Right. All right, man, listen up. Your assignment is to capture the Muppets. Give no ground. Show no mercy. Remember, you are the finest. 
the Disney SWAT team. Good grief. Your people are starting to remind me of my people. I must say, because the wig is a big improvement. It gives you an exotic, almost sultry quality. Bigger this way. Oh. Piggy, wasn't that just the best ride you've ever been on? I mean, wasn't that the best ride in the whole world? Okay, I've got a better one. I bet this is the way to the Magic Kingdom, Uncle Kermit. This will be fun. Yeah, but it's getting late. You know, the scum skimming contest back at the swamp is probably over by now. Mm. Gary usually wins by cheating. He's a scam scum skimmer. Oh, mm. There he is! Agent Grumpy, secure the exit! Agent Bashful, initiate crowd control! Forward, men! Oh, no. I don't see him. He was here a second ago. Rats. You called? No! Don't do that! Uh, he's gone. Oh, no! Robin! Uncle Kermit! When I was a kid, I just slept all day. And then, then I became a poet. I was going from bed to verse. Get it? I was a poet, verse. Wait, come back. Give me a break. <sighs> Are you sure you do this for a living? Oh, Ma. Well, at least those two old hecklers aren't here. Hey, Bear. Sorry we're late. Yeah, you can start the bad jokes now. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Hmm, this doesn't look like the Magic Kingdom. And now, live from the detention hall of the Walt Disney World Pet Care Center, it's showtime. Well, it would take an awful lot of clouds to rain on my parade. Laughing lemonade, man, I got it made. I got a brand new bone to call my own and all the bills are paid. I'm so glad I stayed. I'm dogging it. Root, root, root. Now he don't mind if people call him lazy. Whoop, whoop. If they don't see his highway, his way, that's just crazy. Hey, you know that I could pass the day away just barking up a tree. Root, root, root. Ooh, it's a life for me. I'm dogging it. Root, root, root. Now hey, look at that dog, old man, old man, sing a shoebop, shoebop, bop, bam, shoebam. lead. Oh, Camilla. Look. Come on, let's go this way. My friends are off enjoying themselves. I've looked everywhere for them. And now I've lost Robin, too. And we're missing the whole frog festival and bug fry. Oh, what a disappointment. To think I've been dreaming about this day for years. Well, I guess there are bigger dreams than mine. Hmm? 
What is your dream? Uh, I beg your pardon? I heard what you said. What is your dream? Oh, oh, oh nothing. I, I was just I was just talking to myself. But you look so sad. How come? It's just that I thought my friends would like my old home in the swamp, and they hated it. It was a silly dream. Oh, but my mother said that you should never, ever give up on your dream. Say, did she ever tell you not to speak to strange frogs? This is song you should know. It has a message for you. Now you're going to sing me a song? Why are there so many songs about rainbows and what's on the other side? I don't believe this. Actually, he was a frog. Sing with me. Why not? Have you been half asleep? And have you heard voices? I've heard them calling my name. Is this the sweet sound that calls the young sailor? The voice might be one and the same. Something that I'm supposed to be Someday we'll find it The rainbow connection The lovers, the dreamers, and me You know, this song does make me feel better The lovers, the dreamers, and me You know I should stop moping around and find my friends and take them back to the swamp for the frog festival. That's the spirit. There he is. Get him. Uh, excuse me. I better hop out of here. It's too bad he had to leave. I was going to tell him it's not easy being green. The magical world of Disney will return after these messages. The struggle for excellence is the spirit behind running a business. It's the only way to run an airline. At Northwest, helping you do business is putting us on the fast track. In all we do, we're striving to jump the line from the merely good to being great. Because being the best is the only thing we want to be. There's a chip that's so extra crispy and full of flavor, you want to... Now in rap. Rip into them, rip into them. La 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 la. How lucky to be born today. Because today, new Ultra Pampers are born. One for boys and one for girls. It's going to be the driest Pampers generation ever. The magical world of Disney will return after these messages. Monday, the Hogans are back with a prom laugh attack. There's a heel who's real and girls with appeal. I still got it. It's a treat. It's a feat. So grab a seat. The Hogan family season finale can't be beat. Then a pearl of a girl in the corporate world who's so sexy and smart she'll steal your heart. Working girl after the Hogan family all new Monday. Charlie Browns introduces our prime time players. Jennifer Perry on tables. Chef Ballon Kane on prime rib. John Jensen and his floor show. And headlining every night, our prime time dinners. Featuring our thick, juicy, corn-fed prime rib. Just $9.95 during prime time. From 5 to 7 every day. And we'll even give you free cheesecake. Charlie Brown's. Great prime, great time. Men fighting fat on the next Donahue at 3 on 4. Now, back to our program. 
Look, you've got to help me find the Muppets. Muppets? Muppets. Listen, if you're gonna catch them, you gotta keep your eyes open for the truly strange and bizarre. Excuse me. Eyes open. Eyes are open. Uh. Where can a handsome pig like myself find some nice macho t-shirts with sweet little mice on them? And down the street there on the right. Thank you. Wait a minute. That was a Muppet. You're right. Slow, but right. All right, Turkey. No more free rides. But, Miss Piggy, we haven't even been to Space Mountain or Body Wars no, no, or... No, 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 you do not understand. We are now going to go straight to the Chinese theater at the Disney MGM lot or else. Well, perhaps I'm a fool to ask, but or else what? Oh, what else that? Come on, let's go. Snow White! Hi. Snow White! Power men! Now keep an eye out for anything suspicious. Dopey! Dopey! Keep an eye on that side, the right flank. Dopey! Come on, men, they're not on the ground, they're not in the sky, they're all around in here. Come on, men, you're top men. Act like top men. Uh, the frog went that way. What are you guys doing? Oh, now to find my friends and get back to the swamp. I'll start with Fozzie. How soon can you get film developed around here, he says. And I say to him, someday your prince will come. Get it? Prince film? I, that, that's what we call a Disney joke. No, that's what we call a dismal joke. <laughs> oh, no, please, guys, stop trying to make a fool of me. You don't need our help for that. Do <laughs> you, you think you're so funny? Well, we know you're not so funny. <laughs> oh. Hey, Fozzie, looks like you need some help. Kermit! Oh, Kermit, yes. it's so good to see you. Oh, yes, oh, yes, yes, I do need help, Kermit. Mm -hmm. I don't think I brought the right material. Uh, no, no, Fozzie. I think it's just you're not playing to the right audience. How do you mean? Well, well look over there. Where? See, this is the Country Bear Jamboree. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome, if you will, to one and only Fozzie Bear. Oh. Da, 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 da. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Hiya, 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 hiya. Hi what a wonderful audience. Hey, 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 did you hear the one about the bear who went into journalism? He was a cub reporter. Ah. <laughs> Are we the wrong generation for this comedy? No, the wrong species. Oh. Yep. See, Fozzie, they love you. It doesn't even matter that you're not funny. <laughs> Easy there. You all right, Camilla? Ah. Oh, there we are. Wow. Hey, holy Toledo, look what we've got here. Ah. Walt Disney's Laundry Land. Lordy, it's a dream come true. Ah. Love in a laundromat. Who would have thought? Treat. But I guess it's time we went and found Kermit, huh? Oh, I know. It would have been great to get ourselves steam ironed, but you have to save some of the fun for another day. Oh, boy, Kermit, it was just so great to have you show up and help me with my act. Mm. Yeah, we were getting in trouble without you. Yeah. Oh, it's my pleasure. I just wish I knew where the rest of the gang is. Oh, I bet they're behaving themselves. Sure. Oh, my goodness, what do we have here? Yes, the Indiana Jones stunt show. No, 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 
Oh, Beauregard, we are going to the Chinese theater. Absolutely. And I know a shortcut. Hmm? Come on. Wait, wait, wait. Come wait. on. Wait. No way. No way. No way. Ah. Oh, now, the first place to check is the Chinese theater. I bet Piggy headed that way. Oh, look. This animal. Uh-oh. Looks like trouble. Come on. No way. No way. No way. Please. Hey, I saw a frog heading that way into Indiana Jones' place. Of course, I can't be sure it was Kermit. Phil, how many frogs have we seen around here? Yeah, it was probably Kermit, all right. Mm. I hope so. I miss his little flippery present. <laughs> and now, ladies and gentlemen, before the Indiana Jones epic stunt spectacular can begin, we need some volunteers from our audience today, folks who are willing to be extras in our story today. For instance, uh, we need someone who can play a really sturdy peasant woman. <laughs> <laughs> Any really sturdy peasant women with us today? Will, will you stop <laughs> pushing me? And here she is. Yes, you would be perfect. Perfect for what? Perfect to be on our show today. Your show? Yes, just go right down there and get a costume. Oh, how lovely. Shouldn't we have a deal, Memo? No way, no way, no way, no way. And now we're looking for a real leading man type. Uh, any volunteers for this one? Come on, a real Tom Selleck type. Well, hey, there he is. There's Animal up there. Hey, Animal! Woo! You, sir, thanks what? for volunteering. You'll be perfect. What? What? <gasps> Whoa! Camilla, isn't this terrific? Look what we've discovered. Huh? We're in a sewer. Ah. Boy, nothing can touch the magic of Disney. Ah. Mm. And so, ladies and gentlemen, we finished our casting. Why not sit back and enjoy the filming of the Indiana Jones epic stun spectacular? Scene one, take one, mark. Oh! Oh! Who oh, will save me? Don't worry, Miss Piggy. I will save you. This could be tougher than scum skimming. Uh, now, this is a play gun. It, it's all make-believe. Trust me. Oh, come on. And they say I overact. Ha! Hey, hey, doesn't that lady pig look familiar? Don't all lady pigs look alike? Oh, uh, yeah. Ah! Yeah. Watch the wall! Watch out for the patty holes! Ah! I thought they used stunt people for this. I'd like to go on record as being opposed to the use of violence for purposes of conflict resolution. However... <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> They're taking Miss Piggy for a spin around the block! is not for you. Oh, but Ma, look, they're starting a whole new scene. Oh, that looks worse. I don't believe in violence. I don't believe in violence. You okay? Oh, good. <laughs> Lucky Yeah, they didn't have either one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Piggy, how are we going to explain this to Big Bird? Don't be a smart frog! Nothing interesting happening up here, Camilla. Let's go back to the laundry. Ah.
the magical world of Disney will return after these messages. Get ready. What's your name, dude? Clint Eastwood. What kind of stupid name is that? Get set. It's time to go back. Come on, run! One last time. There's a whole lot! It's a science experiment! Michael J. Fox. Christopher Lloyd. Back to the Future Part 3. Where'd you learn to shoot like this? 7-Eleven. Rated PG. Bridal guidance suggested. Starts Friday, May 25th. Presenting the Fisher Price Triple Skipper. Short jumps, long jumps, high and low jump rope, jumping all day. It's the first jump rope that goes from short to long and has handles that hook around any jump. Jumping jack, jumping slow. One, two, three, can play. Jump rope, jump, fish your back, jump rope, jumping all through the day. Now one, two, or even three kids can jump. Jumping all through the day. The triple skipper jump rope from Fisher Price. Jumping all through the day. If you haven't driven a GM car in the last four or five years, you have no idea how good we are now. We've introduced 77 new models, all engineered to improve quality. Nobody else has done that. We have better engines, transmissions, and electrical systems. We are putting quality on the road today. For Lisa Vinichenko, this is a big day. A very big day. Today, Lisa Vinichenko is getting her first taste of America. The comedy lineup continues. You know the old Alf. I must eat cats. Will a new family kitty mean a new Alf? It'll be like the son I never had. Tasty dessert treat, her furry friend. Oh! Find out next. Then Mary takes to the streets on a special all-new 227. Before he was homeless, he was a St. Bernard. Alf and 227, next. Monday on Hunter, you're invited to the wedding of the year as Dee Dee gets married. It's the end of an era when she and Hunter say goodbye. I'm trade the memories for anything. A special Hunter Monday. Now, back to our program. All right, there's the kid and the little bunny rabbit. Is that the whole gang? Uh, yes, it is, and it's great to see all you guys. Oh, oh so yeah. great Kermit, to see yeah. you, too, Kermit. We missed you. Yeah. Wonderful to be together again. Yeah. yeah, thank you. And listen, if we all hurry, we can get back to the swamp in time for the bug fry. Well, that's uh, what you think. I'm turning you over to the chief. What? Hello, Mr. Mouse. Quentin Fitzwaller here. I have just personally captured the entire insidious evil Kismet gang. Uh, that, that, that's Kermit, not Kismet. It's Kermit the Frog. Excuse me, I'm talking to Mickey Mouse. Yeah, well, Mickey and I are all buddies. I didn't know you knew Mickey Mouse. Uh, sure, we're both members sure. of FASA. FASA? Yes, yeah, sir. fictional animal stars of America. Oh. Now, now, now let, me, let me talk to Mickey. Come on, uh, give me the phone. Come on. Uh, uh, excuse me, excuse me, Mr. Mouse. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Uh, there's a Kermit the Frog mm -hmm. here who claims to have once met you. Really? Oh. Uh, uh, yes, of course. One, one, one moment, sir. Uh huh. Oh. Hello, Mickey. Mickey, this is Kermit the Frog here. Uh, yeah. Well, there's been a little mix-up here. Mickey, buddy. Uh, yeah. Terrific. We'll be right over. Okay, everybody. The office is right down here. And in a second, I'll introduce everybody to Mickey Mouse. Oh, Kermit, I can't see Mickey Mouse looking like this. Well, quick, the purse, please. Thank you. Hello, Mickey. Are you in there? Kermit, is that you? <laughs> Come on in. Gosh, it sure is swell to see all the Muppets here at Walt Disney World. Welcome, everyone. Oh, thanks, Mickey. Hey, I'd like you to meet the gang. There's Fozzie and Floyd and Janice. And here's Bean Bunny and Gonzo and Nephew Robin. And, uh... Ah, where's Miss Piggy? Mickey Moshel! Quel honor to meet you! Ooh. I, how did she do that? If there's one thing Piggy knows, it's how to make an entrance. Mickey, we've had a wonderful time at Walt Disney World. It's like a dream come true. Well, you know what we say. When you wish upon a star, your dreams come true. Well, actually, what we say is, 
Someday you'll find it the Rainbow Connection, the lovers, the dreamers, and me. Uh-oh. They're starting to argue philosophy. <laughs> Now, I'd like to invite all you dreamers to go down to the Chinese theater. Why, why there you can put your names and footprints in the cement. <laughs> Welcome to the family. When the curtain goes up and we hear the applause, it's the moment we live for and you are the cause. We're, We're gonna, gonna keep on singing if you keep bringing your laughter and mayhem. Wahoos and guffaws and we're not gonna stop till we get to the top. With a stomp and a shop, or a skip and a hop. Cause wherever we are and wherever we go, we're ready to rock and we're ready to roll. So raise the curtain and light the lights. It's for certain the time is right. It works together, it works apart. It comes without waiting, and it comes from the heart. So raise the time, brow, and listen here. We got you smiling, we hear you cheer. Cause it's the sound that we adore. We're just shouting more, more, more. And when the drum is flashing, I will pull. World of Disney will return after these messages. Moms everywhere are giving subtle hints about what they want for Mother's Day. Something soothing that feels like a foot massage. Isotoner slippers. And to make her feel good all over, our body refresher kit, free with purchase. Don't you look cute? Don't you look nice? In your new pink rosebuds and blue oxford stripes. New love's friends are tops. In bottoms. Only loves has got them. They're tops. In bottoms. Imagine a Disneyland as big as the city of San Francisco. A Disney world with a surprise around every corner. 43 square miles of tropical paradise. The spectacular Disney MGM Studios theme park. And the incredible Epcot Center. Imagine yourself here. Walt Disney World in Florida, as big as imagination gets. The comic book you grew up with is now grown up, too. Archie comes to life with adult double trouble. You think I'm trying to seduce you? Yeah. It's Veronica. You do catch on quick. Betty. Treat me like a woman. And his fiance, too. Surprise. What is going on? They're all together in the wildest, craziest. It's a bomb. There isn't any. Wow. And the sexiest reunion that they wouldn't dare show in the comic book. I'll be waiting. It's Archie's 15-year class reunion tonight. Well, here we are back in the swamp again. It's like another dream come true. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta admit, Kermit, it is pretty nice. Mm -hmm. Mm. The mosquitoes aren't half bad either. <laughs> hey, you know, it's a great end to a terrific day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey, where's Miss Piggy? I haven't seen her in the longest time. I know. Oh, we left her at the Chinese theater. She was still standing in the wet cement, signing autographs and posing for pictures. Oh, oh no. Uh, everybody back to Walt Disney World. Yeah. Emmy Lou, find us some pickaxes. Oh, Come on, guys, let's go. <laughs> we'll save you. <laughs> Help! 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 
And of course, Miss Piggy gets the last word in the Muppet special at Walt Disney World. Gotta love Miss Piggy. Uh, you know, uh, rest in peace to uh, Charles Grodin, but uh, that, was, uh, that was a fun special. Hope, hope we, hopefully you enjoyed that. Uh, and he had worked, you know, with the Muppets before, too, so it was interesting that he was their go-to guy. You know what I thought was really cool about that special, you may have noticed, is that they showed the underground of uh, Walt Disney World, which is really rare. When uh, Gonzo and the chicken uh, were going around in laundry land, uh, that's really unusual that they showed you behind the scenes of that, uh, which was pretty cool. Also, I thought it was super cool that there was a commercial in there for Back to the Future Part 3, uh, you know, back in the day. Like, oh my God, that was like such a great, you know, expectation when that movie was coming out. Uh, Disney MGM Studios were brand new. Indiana Jones Stunt Spectacular, still one of my very favorite shows. Uh, that was uh, featured in there as well. And uh, good old Michael Eisner. A lot of people gave him crap for putting himself on at the beginning of these specials, saying he wasn't Walt Disney, he shouldn't have done that. I disagree. He gave the company a face and uh, made it fun. And, uh, and this was the best part of the whole special right here. Ah, waka waka. <laughs> Gotta love it. Thanks for watching. It's Jay Rye on Jay Rye World right here. Instagram, YouTube, you know everything about it. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know that you watched. Tell me what you think of the Muppets, and I'll see you right here next time. Thanks, everybody.